guys, this is Tash the Starcross Stitcher. I hope you're all doing well. I'm doing really well. I've got some big news and a finish. The finish isn't the big news. Um, I'll do the finish first. Ta-da! <laughs> this is Stars by The Drawn Thread and I finally finished it. Um, it really didn't take a long time. The only part that took a long time was these houses because I cannot stitch houses. I really hate stitching houses. Um, but there we are. It's all finished and it looks very sweet. Um, I messed up that blue house so much, but it's the fudge was okay. I also, as I was stitching in the stars down the bottom here near the trees, I realized that I had stitched one of the leaves with my crosses going the wrong way, which is really odd. Um, so I fixed that up. The buttons, the chart called for four millimeter buttons. I found some that were labeled as four millimeter, but I think they're actually five. I measured them. Um, and they are a little bigger than uh, how they appear on the on the model picture, but I think they look cute. So there we go. That is Stars by The Drawn Thread. And it's finished, and this is a present for my grandmother. Because um, she used to cross-stitch a lot. She doesn't stitch anymore. Oh, actually, she has started stitching, but she only wants to stitch on Ada, and she's too afraid to do any specialty stitches. And she really loves The Drawn Thread, so um, she'll love this piece. She actually pointed this out as one of her favourites, so... I have a question though. I need to get it over to Perth, that's where she lives, so I need to frame it. Should I frame it here, probably without glass, and post it over there? Will that be safe? Or would I be better off trying to find a framer, post it unframed to the framer, ask the framer to frame it, and then I'm going to send my nana to pick it up? Do you think that would work? Does anyone in Perth know any good framers? Um, yeah, I'm not really sure what to do about that. Um, I was hoping to go over to Perth this year, but I'm just not going to make it. We're currently planning a trip to Europe for next August because my brother's getting married um, in Germany next August, which is really nice to a nice girl. Um, so, yeah, no money left for trips to Perth this year. A flight to Perth is really expensive. Um, it's just the way it is. Perth is a long way away from... It's about as far as it is from, like... Uh, somewhere on the east coast or somewhere on the west coast of the US. Australia is about the size of the US. Anyway, let's talk about the big news. I'm going to have to pick you up and take you over here. So watch out if you feel sick. Here we go. I just want to show you on my computer. If you can see, here's my channel. And over, oops, and over here, look at that. 1,000 subscribers! Oh my god! Woo! I'm so excited! I'm really excited. I thought that would never happen. <laughs> um, it was ho oh, sorry. There you go. You got my hand in your face. Um, it was hovering between 950 and 1,000 for weeks, and it just wouldn't climb. So that was re that's really exciting. Thank you so much, everyone who subscribed. Um, I of course have a giveaway because that's what you do when you hit a thousand subs. I've been planning for a while. I've got at least four different things to give away um, to four different people. I'm going to make a proper video on the weekend to introduce that though. So stay tuned in probably the next video you see, I will have a giveaway. So yay! I'm really happy about that. Thank you everyone. Um, I hope you like my finish. I'm just going to, it's only eight o'clock on Friday night, so I'm just going to get some work done on and a forest screw. So yeah, I hope you all have a great weekend. I will see you at some point on the weekend for the giveaway video. Um, see you later. Bye.